One of the things that I think all of us have been a little bit worried about as you hear the, the concepts of AI is this sense of the robots taking over, or maybe a, a slightly more rational, pragmatic, and immediate fear is that AI doesn't know what it needs to learn, and I don't know what variables it's considering and what it's not considering. So the way we approach that at the trade desk was to make individual algorithms and instances of AI answer essentially one question. So instead of having one algo or one thing to rule them all, we are not trying to create chat GPT where you can ask any question and it will answer any question. Instead, we are trying to say, what is the value of this particular impression to this advertiser? That would be a value algorithm where we're leveraging AI and that value algorithm to, in some cases, figure out what variables to consider so that we know how to value that impression for that particular advertiser. That is a different question than what does it take to clear the auction after I've assigned value? What is it worth to me is different than what do I have to pay? So let's answer that in a separate instance using separate data science, separate AI, separate info, so that we make the very best decision about that question by isolating those and essentially taking inputs and outputs from all of these different efforts and injecting them into each other, we create a system of checks and balances that are always working to your advantage. One of the things we tried to do in the past is essentially write COA to do everything. And you would just turn COA on on everything. At times I would criticize this in our own four walls where I'd say, sometimes I think we describe COA like it's magic, that it just solves any individual problem or any group of problems. Instead, we need to be much more focused about what we're trying to solve. So in Kokai, you will see for the very first time that you can turn on COA on individual elements. So we're creating much more clarity. Who's in control? Is it the pilot or the co-pilot or autopilot? And by giving you that control, you can always take it back. You can always start it with COA and then you take control. By, by giving you that uh, level of control, number one, you do know that you can touch anything and you can know things that the system doesn't know. Of course, that's always been the case and will likely always be the case. That gives you, the user, the power.